That's good, Jules. Keep it up. Dad, I told you, I already know how to drive. Do you, though? What's that supposed to mean? Well, for one, you crashed that boat a while back. You're really gonna join forces against me here. That was all Dad's fault. He was in my head. Jules is right. Let's not point golden fingers at each other here. Let's just stay focused on the road. After all, we don't want her to crash again. <sighs> that was Your Legacy by Mr. Kent and Ruby Red. Coming up next, more of your favorite copyright-free tracks. But first, a message from our sponsors. Hey guys, this is Ryan. And I'm Katie. And we're from Newscape Pro. We're here to ask you to subscribe to all of our Fortnite channels. That's Newscape Pro 1, 2, 3, and 4. She sounds familiar for some reason. Yes, and the fellow does as well, though I can't quite put my finger on it. But Katie, aren't you forgetting something? Oh, that's right. Our news channel just launched. It's got all sorts of info on the game, including storyline and lore explanations. So make sure to check it out in the description below. Description below? Below what? This is nonsense. I honestly don't know, but for some reason I can't stop listening. I know what you mean. Uh, guys? Quiet down, kid. We're engaged here. But guys, look out! Huh? Hmm? Ah! Thanks, and enjoy, enjoy the, the video. video! The Fortilla is dead ahead. Gassels! They're everywhere! Oh. oh geez, this place is a full-on war zone! What do we do, Paul? Go! That's an order. Okay, come on, Kit. No, be careful, Dad. I've been waiting a long time for this moment. Today, Ghost dies, and you, my friend, die with it. Mm. Uh oh! What's uh oh? No uh oh! I'm out of ammo. Just our luck. I've got you right where I want you. No, Ollie! Ollie! Hey there! Uh, what the? Yeah! We need to get off the main roads. Do you have anywhere in mind? I know a place. We should be able to hide out there. Just point the way, Sky. You got it. Jules, it's just up ahead. Good thing, too. This truck has seen better days. Here we are. Wow! Whose house is this? Ours. For now. It was abandoned, so unless the owners show up, we should be good. Hold on. Sky, you're back! And look, you found them! Sure did. Just in time, too. They were being chased by that lady bounty hunter. Vega. Hard to believe she's still in this fight. <laughs> You guys are lucky. She's ruthless. I know. We fought before. I actually fed her to a shark, but I guess it didn't take. She's a persistent one, ain't she? Either way, she was no match for my blades. <laughs> Few are. No surprise there. But enough about that. What do you guys think? Cool hideout, huh? It's nice. Much fancier than the corner. The Fortilla too. Yeah, and it's got a state-of-the-art security system, too. <laughs> Whoever it was that abandoned this place put a lot of money into it. That'll come in handy. Is it just the two of you here? Did no one else make it out? Well, we weren't actually at the Fortilla when it was attacked. We were here. We only knew about your escape from listening into the radio broadcast about that gas station explosion. Oh, right. That wasn't actually our fault, by the way. Either way, it's lucky we heard it, or else you two might be in the authorities' clutches again. Speaking of, we left a lot of people behind at the Fortilla. What's our plan to get them back? Sky and I have been working on that. Unfortunately, the cell towers at the Fortilla were busted in the attack, so we can't get a message out. And if anyone has escaped, they can't or haven't attempted to contact us. So right now, we're gonna have to plan a recon mission. I'm in! Kit, your dad asked me to keep you away from there. We can't just go marching right back in. But, but... Uh, we can talk about this in the morning. For now, you guys have had a long eventful day and I think you've earned some rest. That sounds good. Is that alright with you, Kit? Yeah, okay. But we're gonna talk about our plan first thing in the morning. First thing. We promise.
Jules! Jules! You awake? Uh-huh. Kit? Can I come in? Uh, yeah, I guess. Thanks. I couldn't sleep. What's up, Kit? Well, I've just been thinking about me poor, Kyo, and Happy. I shouldn't have just left them there. I feel awful. Kit, you can't blame yourself. That was an impossible situation. And you're not some superhero. You were in real danger. I know, but my dad might have signed up for this fight. But they didn't. It's not fair. If they got hurt, I don't know what I'd do. I, I think I made a mistake. Nonsense. Dad? Huh? You getting one of your flashes, Jules? Yeah. Kit needs guidance. Allow me to speak through you. Okay. Tell me, Kit. Do you know the difference between an error and a mistake? Um, no. Not really, Jules. It's not me, Kit. It's my dad. Whoa. I'm talking to Midas? Allow me to continue. Anyone can make an error. But that error doesn't become a mistake until you refuse to correct it. So you agreed I made an error? I do. Everyone has done so. Me, most of all. Though some errors are far greater than others, I sense your family and friends have not yet joined me here in the beyond. There is still time to correct your error. However, you must be careful. Careful how? In your quest to redeem yourself, you mustn't lose sight of yourself, or else there will be consequences. People you love could get hurt. I myself am still working through all the pain I caused. But I just want to help. The time will come, and when it does, I will be here to help Jules guide you. Thanks. Mm. Whew. That was weird. First time for everything, I guess. Yeah. Your dad's pretty smart, huh? Yeah. I guess he is. Any injuries from today? A little bruise on my ankle from falling from the helicopter. Nothing major. Want me to look at it? <laughs> I'm alright, but thanks. Sky, I'm... I'm just so glad you're back. Ollie! And Ollie's glad too. <laughs> me too. The year I spent as Eternal Knight, I... I was just so full of hate. I understand. I've been there. After I thought my parents died, the fire inside me wouldn't stop raging. It came out again recently, actually. When? When you were brought into the Fortilla, I was this close to setting Jules on fire. Well, I'm glad you didn't. It wasn't her fault. It was the boss man's. Mm, you're still calling him that, huh? We... we talked. At least I think it was him. He explained everything, and I forgave him. Hmm. You're a kinder soul than I. So, what are you going to do about Ultima Knight? Isn't leaving his order kind of a big deal? I don't actually know. My time there, it feels so foreign to me now. I guess being in a coma might have changed your attitude on a lot of things. Yeah, take it from me, someone who's been literally dead before. It was a different experience. We live odd lives, don't we? That's the life of a legendary adventurer. <laughs> okay, legendary adventurer. How about we get some sleep? We've got another big day tomorrow. Oh, is that really what you want? It's one of our first nights back together. Well, <laughs> I guess we could stay up for a little while longer. Sweet. It's good to be back.